cannot jump. You cannot so jump that far. No. Are you ready to go potty? Let's go potty, come on. Brenner's ready to go potty. Let's go potty. We're so ready. <laughs> Careful, brother. Jeez. Get the morning zoomies in. Good girl. Her nose hurts, get a treat. Here, sit. Good girl. You're crazy. <laughs> what are you eating? Don't eat that. No. Are you already eating your food? Mom didn't refill it yet. Let's see if brother's ready to come in yet. Oh, there he is. Look how handsome he is. Hi, brother. Are you ready to come in? Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my channel. Bubba wants a little bit of attention. I don't know why him does that. We are having a little morning routine this morning with the puppy, and I just got done feeding them, as you saw. But now I'm gonna let her back out because I feel like she doesn't get all of her pee out right in the morning. So we're just gonna go out just her because I don't want her to get distracted by her brother. No, Bubba's. No, we're not playing. We're not outside to play. No, let go. Good girl. Mama knew you had to go potty. You're going to poop, huh? Good girl. That's Mama's good girl. Come on, let's go inside. Anyway, good morning. As I was saying, I feel like I was rushed to say that. What do you want? You feel that I don't give you attention, but I give you a lot of attention. Usually I would be getting ready for church, but I don't, I don't have the heart to leave my baby yet, so I'm just gonna do church on TV today. I'm a little helicopter mom and don't wanna leave my baby. She like had a little bit of worms when like her owner took her to the vet, so I have to give her like some of this medicine. I think that today is the last day of the medicine that I have to give it to her. She is crazy. You're crazy. But she's about to knock over our table, table I swear. Yesterday it was a pain in the butt trying to give it to her because she just did not sit still to take it. Come here. Yeah, this is your medicine. Come here. You have to be a good girl. Ready? Open up. Open up. Oh, that's a good girl. Good girl, you hardly even fought me today. Yesterday, it was like WWE. Yes, now you're gonna be all better. You finished all your medicine. Good girl, honey. But anyway, today I have kind of like a busy day. I have to finish editing, bring you her home video. I need to do my church on TV, which that only takes like 30 minutes. And then our neighbor also asked me last night if I could do her makeup. Today's her birthday and she's getting pictures done with her and her husband today. So I'm gonna do her makeup for that. I don't know what time that is. I think that's this afternoon though. And then also, I think my family's coming out like my aunt and my cousins and maybe my grandma, I don't know, to see the new puppy. So, kind of a busy day. And I also started season two of Love is Blind last night. So like, I kind of want to binge watch that for a little bit, you know? I watched three episodes last night, I think. So yeah, we need to watch some more now. Huh, Granger? Hungry Ranger. Did you go eat your food? It's so bizarre to me that I have two golden retrievers. Like, this is a dream come true, but it's just so bizarre to me. I think they're the cutest freaking dogs ever, and I am just so blessed to have them. I'm just so blessed to have two golden babies. I'm blessed to be your mama. Look at her, she's trying to get up on the couch. Get up there. Get up there. Get up there. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Oh, so close. Yeah. Wow. Okay, so why Little Miss tears everything up out there? I think she's currently on the couch, like eating up her blanket, but that's fine. I'm gonna get myself a little bit ready because I need to take care of myself too, you know? So first I'm gonna brush my teeth. I have lipstick all over my toothbrush. That's disgusting. <laughs> Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Oh, you're looking at yourself in the mirror. You're looking at yourself in the mirror. Okay, and I feel like my 
skin has been doing amazing like the past like few weeks. I have like one little blackhead coming in right here and then like just a little scabbing right here. But other than that, I have no like texture on my face. It's basically all scarring, which I literally hate. I don't know how to get rid of the scarring. But yeah, my face has been feeling amazing and I feel like there's two reasons for that and I will show you guys. So for like the past two weeks now, I've been using this Duval Radiance skincare system and it has literally become my favorite thing in the world other than like honey and granger literal favorite thing in the world it's this like face washing brush thing and it is so amazing it came with four different heads what is honey doing you better not be eating your brother's food hey what's on your face so it came with four different head attachments. This one's just like the regular cleansing brush. This one is the exfoliating one. And it came with this one, which is like for your feet. So you can like literally give yourself a pedicure at home, which is so amazing. I haven't tried this one because I don't have like a foot bath thing, but I'm definitely gonna get one because I wanna try it. It also comes with one that you can use on your entire body. Let me get it, it's in the shower. So it's this big thing. And and it is heavenly. Honestly, I didn't think I would use this shower one because I just felt like I would never remember to take this into the shower and use it or just I felt like it would take way longer to wash my body in the shower with this, but it's actually it's about the same time and this gets your body feeling so much more clean and it's so nice. So I've been obsessed with this, but I use the cleansing one like every single day and then maybe like every two days I'll do the exfoliation one and this is extreme. Like you can literally feel like it's exfoliating your face. But I wanted to thank Duval for sending this out to me. I was honestly showing this to my brother the other night and I was like telling him how it was my favorite thing. But yeah, I'm gonna wash my face with the just cleansing one. I'm just gonna get it damp. And then I stick it on there. And then I don't think I have any more of my acne face wash, so. Oh, there's a little bit. <laughs> Honestly, like before this, I would just wash my face with my hands and I feel like my face is doing so much better because this is like really using its power to get deep down into my skin and make the product work and absorb into my skin. So it has like an on and off button that you can use. Hey, she's over there trying to get herself in the mirror. And I just put it on my face and then press the on button and it just spins in a circle and I just go all over my face. And I could never get this cleanser to foam before when I would just use my hands. I would always have to mix in my other foaming cleanser, but literally I just use this cleanser and it's so foamy. So I love that, which makes me feel like it's actually working and doing something. Hey, stop. That's you, that's the pretty girl that you see in the mirror. So the spinning motion of the brush like offers superior like cleaning of dirt, makeup, oil, dead skin cells, all that stuff, which is much more effective if I were just to use like my hands and do it without the brush. Like I said, I literally just use this and go around my face for like maybe a minute or two because it just honestly feels so good. It's like massaging. I can literally like just feel it getting clean. So I love that. Where'd your sister go? Go get her. And then the other reason why I feel like my face has been doing so well is because I dry it with paper towels instead of like actual towels. I just let go of my face and dab off all the water and it just absorbs really easily. I've seen some other people doing this and why they're doing it, it just makes so much sense. Like when you do this, you throw the paper towel away after you use it, you don't like reuse it, meaning you don't get like old bacteria on your face. Cause if you're like reusing this every time, which I did, I would reuse it for like a week straight and I'm just putting old bacteria on my face. But with paper towel, you use it and you throw it away and you get a new one the next time. And I feel like this has been game changing for my face, honestly. And yeah, we love. So if you guys wanted to try this Duval Radiance Care System and get this brush with the four attachments, you can go to the link in my description box and use the code CHANEL and get 70% off. That's literally insane, 70%. So I think after you use the code, it's literally like $28 or something for all four attachments and the actual brush, which is amazing. So again, go to the link in my description box and use the code CHANEL and get 70% off. And thank you for sending me this skincare system. I love. <laughs> and then I've been using the Fenty Skin Invisible Moisturizer. It's just the mini size, but I actually really love this. It's so nice. 
So I'm probably gonna have to invest in the bigger size. What is she doing? What are you doing? What are you doing over there? It just makes my skin feel like so smooth, but it doesn't, I feel like it doesn't leave it like oily or like shiny or anything. Hey, that's my robe. Girl, that's my robe. Where are you going with that? That is my robe. <laughs> hey ma'am, I need that. That's not yours, you little thief. That's not yours, you little thief. Give me that. Give me that. Okay, I promise I'm gonna get through this really fast. Then the last thing I put on my lips is this Lano Lips Lip Mask. Ever since I started using a lip mask, like I cannot stop. They're like my favorite thing. I always have to have something on my lips just to make them feel like super moisturized and not dry and peely and stuff. That's gross, but skincare and stuff is all done and it took literally so much time with the puppy because I had to keep stopping and checking up on her and telling her no. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Honey. We have a dog on the loose. Honey, what are you doing? That's my slipper, you little thief. This is not gonna go well. Granger never chewed on any of mom's stuff. Look at her, she keeps doing that to the mirror. <laughs> Who is that pretty girl in the mirror? -y? <laughs> She's so clumsy. Look, here's all your toys. Do you want a toy? There's your carrot. Honey, get your carrot. Good girl, get your dumbbell. Here's your llama. She said, the carrot will do, mom, thank you. <laughs> Ritter, what are you gonna get? Are you gonna go get one? You get one. He's like, I want the ball that's way down at the bottom. And now that we're all cleaned, it's time to make some coffee and some breakfast. Yeah, I'm kinda hungry. morning I've been mixing my Suja Mighty Dozen. This is the apple, celery, cucumber, kale, and collard greens. This one is like sweet if you guys were wanting to try one, but it's like a little sweeter. And then I also mix it with the apple cider vinegar. Honestly, when you mix it with this or like the celery juice, you cannot taste it. It just makes it a little more tart, but you cannot taste it. So that's what I'm gonna do. And I only don't even do that much. I only do half a serving a day just to make it last longer because it is kind of pricey. And then I just do like 15 milliliters of this. Hey, that's my slipper again. No, you thief. Get back here with mom's slipper. No, we don't chew on shoes. You're a crazy girl. Tell them how crazy you're being this morning. Tell them how crazy you're going. You're going 90 to nothing. She's probably gonna be the problem child. She's very good, she just is crazy. Granger was a literal angel, so she's probably gonna be a little more mischievous. Huh, huh, baby girl. Rock goodbye, baby, in the treetop. When the wind blows, the cradle will rock. So cute. And then I just swirl it and mix it around. Hi, Bubba's. Hi. <laughs> swirl it and mix it around, and then usually just chug it. So, coffee is made, but before I make my breakfast, I think I'm gonna try and take her out again because she just got done playing with Granger for a while and I just don't want any accidents in the house, so we're just gonna take her out as often as I can. So I had to come show you guys what Miss Honey did. So <laughs> this always like sits right here for now and she came up and like jumped on it. <laughs> It fell, she tumbled down the stairs, and obviously it broke, so that's cool. I mean, I wasn't like a big fan of it anyway, but yeah, she destroyed it, so that's fun. Okay, so I just made some oatmeal real fast, so you can see that. Oatmeal, protein powder, peanut butter, honey, get down. Oh, honey, I put honey on my oatmeal. Blueberries, raspberries, and chia seeds. I also have my vitamins that I'm taking. Oh no. Yeah. But yeah, I think, what time is it now? It's 9.17, so I'm gonna eat my breakfast. Probably watch a YouTube video while I do that, and then I'm gonna do church, because I'm not gonna eat while I'm doing church. So yeah, this will be Honeybee's first time going to church. Probably gonna snooze right through. Okay, so. We, or I, just got done doing church on TV. I honestly wanted to get changed out of my pajamas before I did that, but I just t totally forgot. But we are gonna get changed now to something, not pajamas, you know? 
You little shit, she stole my freaking slipper again. I cannot with this girl. Ma'am, that is not a toy. That is a shoe, not a toy. No, you have toys for a reason. Honey was literally just like pawing at herself in the mirror. And good thing I was standing here because this mirror literally just came like falling right at me. If I wouldn't have been here, it would literally would have slammed against this and shattered everywhere. So that's good. <laughs> but I decided to throw on, watch out bubbles, some black leggings, the slippers that she keeps stealing. So she'll stop stealing them. And then this like cropped hoodie. It's like super nice outside and it's supposed to be like in the 70s all week. So I'm so excited. Granger and I are going to go on all the walks, but I'm really sad to leave Honey behind. That's why I didn't go to church today. It was because I don't want to put her in her kennel because I just don't want to hear her whine. Like, it's going to break my heart. But I mean, I know it's not for that long. So I'm maybe going to try and go on a walk later today for this first time and do it so that we can go on a walk every day this week because that's Granger and I's bonding time is when we go for walks. And eventually, like, when Honey gets older, I can, like, teach her how to leash train and everything and she can join us, I guess, which was going to be an absolute disaster. But dog mom life of two now, huh? So so something I've been doing lately to like cut down my time on getting ready because if I don't I can literally sit here for like 30 to 45 minutes just spending time like on my face doing my makeup and I just don't want that like I can get ready in like 10 minutes and it basically look the same I just like have a timer set so I you know feel like I'm using use utilizing my time a lot faster so what I've been doing is setting a timer for 10 minutes every single time I do my makeup and I have to be done like doing my makeup by the time my timer goes off if I'm like doing something while my timer goes off I can like finish that step but I'm done after that so it just really makes me move a lot faster and get a lot more done <laughs> instead of literally wasting you know 45 minutes at a time so I'm gonna do my makeup We did it. Doing this like little makeup hack, just setting a timer for 10 minutes, literally saves so much time. And it's perfect with a puppy because I don't have a lot of time to waste, you know, just messing around doing my makeup and stuff. Luckily she fell asleep and is just sleeping right there. I can see her. So I highly suggest that if you're like me, if you can just like be really slow and take your time with doing your makeup, start setting a timer because it's gonna save you so much time. Also, I wanted to show you guys something that helps me do that easier is by using like a palette like this. So this is the Physician's Formula All-Star Face Palette. And I love it because everything I need for my face, minus like my foundation and concealer, is here. So I have like contour, bronzer, highlights, and a blush. This is like a setting powder, but I don't use that because, I don't know, I just haven't tried it. But literally everything I need here. So I just have to get this out compared to getting out like six different things. It's all in one. It's going to help you cut down on a lot of time. I think I'm gonna wear some earrings today. I haven't literally wore these in forever, which I think I was wearing these earrings when I got like plowed over at the Chiefs game because I have a back on this one, but I don't have a back on this one. And when that happened, my earring got knocked out of my ear because I got ran over so hard that I lost the back. So I'm pretty sure that these are what I was wearing, but I don't remember. That was a long time ago. So I'm just gonna steal some off of another earring and use that. I used to be obsessed with these, but I never really wear hoops that often anymore. We will do some little hoops for today. Now I need to fix my hair. Okay, so I just did like a little slicked back bun moment just because it's close to being like hair wash day and it's kind of greasy and stuff. So just works out perfect for that hairstyle. Hi sister. Hi brother. Got my babies here. They follow me around everywhere. But now I need to figure out like what time I'm doing my neighbor's makeup. I need to figure out what time my family might be coming out because this floor is actually so dirty. From my slippers and from her, she rolls around out there in the dead grass and then it gets stuck to her and then it just like falls off everywhere throughout this house. So I honestly need to vacuum and kind of clean up a bit. I also need to edit. So I was trying to figure out what I should do now. Let me get my phone out. Out to text. Oh, my neighbor just texted me. Cool. So she said that I don't have to do her makeup anymore. So that's nice. Not that it was like a big deal, but it's just one less thing I have to do today. And now I need to text my family and see if they're coming out or what's going on. 
Brother, I can't see when you're over my phone. I'm kind of scared to vacuum because Granger, I mean, Granger's used to the vacuum. He doesn't mind it. But this is gonna be like Honey's first time being around a vacuum and I don't wanna like scare her. Uh, so yeah, I don't know what to do. But I'm about to go get the vacuum and Little Mish is probably gonna be so scared. Okay, so she hasn't acted crazy yet, but I haven't turned it on also. So let's see what she does. No reaction. I have a feeling when I put her down, she's gonna be like, what the hell is that? Well, she don't like it. <laughs> I feel so bad. You don't like it? But anyway, I'm gonna vacuum this floor real fast and then I don't know what the plan is, honestly, so yeah. Fall into my covers Where they sink One by one Yeah, I watch them Disappear to nothing Disposable As chewing gum There are deal breakers Where I come from My family don't suffer Fools glad they know Do we kiss and lie in bed To feel awkward silences do we feel emptiness afterwards? Cause I want something deeper If I'm a find a keeper Not saying I'm some genius So I just talked to my little cousin and she said that they will probably be coming out around like 1.45 or 2 o'clock and it is currently 11.36 so that means I have time to work on editing and get that done and hopefully my video up soon. It's so crazy to me that like right now in this moment YouTube has no idea that we have another puppy but we've had her for 48 hours. It feels so much longer than that. It feels like I've had her for like a week but it's so crazy that YouTube just doesn't know that yet because I haven't posted that video, but they will know in a few hours sometime today. So yeah, if you haven't watched our bringing our puppy home video, go watch it. I'll link it up here. Hers is so cute, huh? I also need to read my daily devotional. This is the New Morning Mercies book. Um, I talked about it in my Amazon haul. I've been doing this every single morning and I love it. Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going? You're so cute. You're so cute. Go on. I'll let you run free. But I haven't read it today. I usually read it like first thing in the morning, but that's when I'm like working because I just leave it on my desk. But I have to remember to grab it on the weekends because I just don't see it. But today is, what is today? The 27th. So this is the reading that I have today. It's kind of a longer one. Like every reading is only a page, but these both are gonna be like a full page. Sometimes they're like, you know, that short or whatnot. But yeah, I'm gonna read this. And then I'm just gonna edit until my family comes because I need to get that video up. So I think I'm just gonna close the video out here. I hope you guys liked this little morning routine. This is not like the same exact way that we have our mornings every day. Like I said, it's literally only the second morning with her. She does pretty good throughout the night. So this morning I got up at six. 30 and took her out and then we didn't get up again until like 8 15 or whatever I can't remember what time so yeah she does really good throughout the night I just didn't feel me taking her out at 6 30 this morning because I was tired and yeah I'm just chit chatting your little ear away right now so yeah if you guys like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up leave a comment down below what you want to see next if you haven't already make sure to hit the subscribe button so you never miss a future upload from me and make sure to check out the Deval spin care system because it is literally heaven love it so much and yeah be sure to use my code so you can get a lot of dollars off because I'm pretty sure without the discount it's like 90 some dollars but if you use my 70% discount it's 28.50 so but yeah anyway thank you guys so much for watching and I guess until next time I will see you in my next video bye guys thanks for watching go out and make the world smile